This is Tim from Midwest Hunting and Outdoors. In this episode, we're going to discuss food plots, so stay tuned. Hi, this is Tim and Dole. Welcome to Midwest Hunting and Outdoors by Two Dumbasses, a podcast about the outdoors, hunting, and being a steward of the land. Hey, if you like what these two dumbasses are doing, please hit the like button and subscribe today. Hi everyone, this is Tim from Midwest Hunting and Outdoors. Today we're going to talk to you and give you a little bit of an update on food on food plots, most specifically for dove. And as you've been, if you've been following us, we've been uh, playing with doing food plots for, uh, this is our third year. Our first year we planted uh, sorghum, had, uh, we had pretty good luck with the sorghum. However, the deer ended up uh, eating it at the end of the year and uh, grass was also a concern so talking to our local or our county uh wildlife biologists they said hey you know really really sunflowers is the way you want to go so the next year we planted sunflowers um again grass was an issue and uh so were the deer uh the deer really uh took a liking to sunflowers and uh if you have any kind of deer population in your area, you're going to need an electric fence. We're going to talk more about that in a little bit. So this is our third year, and uh, we're having some really good luck this year. So uh, a couple little learnings to, I wanted to pass on to you is, is, one is I did a little research. If you buy fresh crop uh, bird seed, so sunflowers that is for bird seed, and I used uh, black oil sunflower seeds is what I use this year. I saw the kernels that I was looking for is gonna is gonna meet my needs, and uh, but I'd also bought about 10 pounds of hybrids before I did all that research. So don't do that because that'll cost you a lot of money. Uh, so what we ended up doing was is planting all 30 pounds over in an acre. Pretty sure I've overplanted it, uh, but um, wasn't sure what the germination rate was going to be on that on that uh, bird seed sunflowers and. And as you'll soon see, the germination was really good. Uh, so with that said, uh, a couple learnings. You need to control the grass early on. So when the sunflowers got to be about four or five inches, and it does not take very long for that to happen, uh, you need to spray it with clefidin. Clefidin or a material just like that. And uh, the mixing rates that I used was one ounce of clefidin, one ounce of uh, crop oil. Um, I guess is to make that a little hotter and stick to the stick to the grass, and then uh, per gallon of water. And it uh, worked really good. I, I hand applied it, uh, so worked really slick. I'm trying to think of what else I wanted to share with you. Uh, as you see, we got an electric fence behind us. Uh, again, we'll talk more about that. We're actually going to put together a quick episode on that. I think that's about it. So we're going to put together another clip uh, in the future on this just so that you can see uh, how it's progressing. But I'm, in, I'm expecting it's going to do pretty well. My understanding, talking to our biologist on the deer part, is that uh, white-tailed deer will, once they find out what sunflowers are, they'll, if it doesn't have a, a head on it, they'll eat it right to the ground. So usually that's about four foot, and uh, right now we're at about two foot, and it's grow as we get more heat, these sunflowers are really growing. I did put a little bit of fertilizer on them just to give them a little boost. Not sure that's necessary, but I had it, so that's what I did. And uh, again, I can't stress enough getting that grass under control. So stay tuned for uh, future episodes. Until next time, be safe, have fun and get outdoors. Thanks for listening or watching our show. We have some exciting topics and guests coming up. We ask that you subscribe to our channel on YouTube and follow us on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. We look forward to hearing your suggestions for topics, questions, and comments. This is Two Dumbasses signing off. Until next time, be, be safe, safe, have, have fun, fun, and, and get, get outdoors. outdoors.